Hello and welcome back to Dental Basics with me, Dr. Parvati Raghavan. In this video, we are going to learn about local anesthetics used in dentistry, its composition and function. First, we have the main component that is the local anesthetic agent, lignocaine hydrochloride. 2. Vasoconstrictor adrenaline 3. Antioxidant Sodium metabisulfide, fungicide thymol, bacteriostatic methyl paraben, distilled water, isotonic solution of sodium chloride or ringer lactate solution. To adjust the pH, sodium hydroxide. Dental cartridges also contain nitrogen bubbles, 1 to 2 mm diameter in size. Mnemonics to remember the contents are L for lignocaine, A for adrenaline, S for sodium metabisulfite, T for thymol, M for methyl paraben, D for distilled water, S for sodium chloride, S again for sodium hydroxide and bubbles in the end. So here there are three sodium compounds. Starting with the first main ingredient, the local anesthetic agent. Example is lignocaine hydrochloride. Since it is the most popularly used drug for all bit, that is block, infiltration and topical. It is used in 2% concentration which is equal to 20 mg per ml. When LA is injected into the tissue, the blood vessels in that area dilate, that is widen, increasing the blood flow. This leads to 1. Increased bleeding at the site of injection. 2. LA is quickly absorbed into bloodstream. This leads to higher level of the drug and risk of overdose reaction. 3. LA is quickly removed from the injection site, so the duration of action is less making it less effective in producing required anesthesia. To counteract this vasodilatory effect, vasoconstrictors are added to constrict the blood vessels and control tissue perfusion. Adrenaline is the most widely used vasoconstrictor in a concentration of 1 is to 80,000. This is just an example which means that 1 gram of the solute is dissolved in 80,000 ml of solution. It causes constriction of blood vessels, which reduces the vascular uptake of LA, so a higher volume of LA remains in the injected area around the nerve branch and for a longer time. This is helpful because then we can use just a small volume of LA for anesthesia. We may conclude that vasoconstrictors help by 1. Increasing the duration of action of LA 2. Reducing bleeding at the injection site as well as reducing systemic toxicity because less LA is absorbed therefore lower levels of LA in blood so less in the system. All these are the advantages of using a vasoconstrictor in the local anesthetic solution. Adrenaline by tartrate is the most commonly used drug. The vasoconstrictors used in LA are all sympathomimetic amines. That is, they mimic or copy the sympathetic effects produced by the adrenaline, which naturally occurs in our body. Our body produces adrenaline hormone when a person is excited, angry or frightened, making our heart rate faster preparing the body to react to danger. Epinephrine is also called adrenaline. Epi means above and nephros means kidney. Ad means adjacent to. Renal again means kidney. But adrenaline, one, makes the pH of LA acidic. Two, they tend to be unstable in solution form and are broken down by oxygen that might be present or diffused through the rubber dam during storage. 
The solution oxidizes and discolors. It turns brown especially if left exposed to sunlight for a long time and can't be used then. LA can also deteriorate in infrared radiation or fluorescent light or ultraviolet radiation. The heat that we feel from a fire, a radiator or a warm sidewalk are all examples of infrared radiation. Tube light is fluorescent and light cure units used in the clinic emit UV light and radiation. Ultraviolet radiations are nowadays also used for sterilization. Ultraviolet germicidal irradiation is a sterilization method used in hospitals and dental clinics, etc., to destroy airborne microorganisms. UVGI is most often used as a lamp in operating room for air purification or as a lighted box for sterilization of equipments and instruments. These high energy short wavelength radiations damage the DNA and RNA of the microorganisms preventing their reproduction. The whole point of mentioning all this is that LA with vasoconstrictors when exposed to UVGI can also undergo degradation. So vasoconstrictors reduce shelf life of LA by about 12 to 18 months. As the LA reaches closer to its expiry date, the vasoconstrictor in it breaks down further, lowering the pH, causing more burning sensation to the patient on injection into the tissue as compared to when a fresh solution of LA is used. To prevent this instability, we add a substance which will react with oxygen before the vasoconstrictor does. The next third ingredient added is antioxidant, sodium metabisulfide. It can also be called as a reducing agent. Reducing agents remove oxygen from other substances. It competes for the available oxygen and thus increases shelf life of LA. But even this has its negative points. Sodium bisulfide plus oxygen gives rise to sodium bisulfate, which is acidic. And this causes delay in onset of anesthesia and also burning sensation on injection. Do you know that sodium metabisulfite is used frequently as a preservative for baked goods, biscuits, cookies, jams, etc. due to its antioxidant property? Getting back to our main topic. A quick recap. Local anesthetic drugs have vasodilate reaction on blood vessels. To counteract it, we add vasoconstrictor adrenaline but it gets broken down by oxygen. To remove oxygen we add antioxidant sodium metabisulfide but it makes the solution acidic. Another important factor to consider is that LA drugs are hydrochloride salt. To be injected for anesthesia they have to be in solution form. These salts are dissolved in saline or water to form injectable solution of LA. So fourth addition is isotonic solution of sodium chloride that is normal saline. Isotonic means similar tone or pH as body fluids. Body fluids have a pH ranging from 7 to 7.4 and it is slightly different in different tissues in the body. Normal saline has a pH of about 5. Ringer solution can also be used instead. It contains sodium, potassium, chloride and calcium ions along with lactate, giving it a composition more similar to ECF with a pH of 6.5. When the LA solution is similar to the tissue fluid where it is injected, patient discomfort on injection is minimized. Distal water is also added for diluting and increasing the volume of LA. To adjust the pH of the solution, sodium hydroxide, which is a base, may also be used.
LA solution tends to become cloudy due to proliferation of minute fungi. To prevent this, a fungicide thymol is used. A preservative increases the shelf life to 2 years or more and 1 mg of methyl paraben is used for the same. In fact, it is the most frequently used antimicrobial preservative in cosmetics. It also occurs naturally in several fruits, particularly in blueberry and saffron. But methyl paraben often causes allergic reactions to LA. So, capril hydrocuprinotoxin is used instead. Lastly, dental cartridges containing LA also contain small nitrogen bubbles, which you can sort of see here. This is the syringe for loading cartridge and needle for injection. The air that we breathe contains 78% nitrogen and 21% oxygen. Nitrogen is an inert gas, meaning it doesn't chemically react with other gases and it is also non-toxic. It is present in all living things, including human body and plants. But oxygen is very reactive and nitrogen can easily displace oxygen in air. Due to this reason, nitrogen is used to counter the effects of oxygen. Nitrogen bubble 1 to 2 mm in diameter prevents oxygen from being trapped in the cartridge and destroying the vasoconstrictor. Let us finish off with the composition and function of each component very briefly. Local anesthetic agent, a drug that blocks conduction. Vasoconstrictor, example adrenaline, increases depth and duration of LA. Reducing agent, sodium metabisulfite, fungicide, thymol, bacteriostatic, methyl paraben or capril hydrocuprinotoxin, for diluting distilled water, to make solution isotonic, sodium chloride or Ringer lactate solution, to adjust the pH, sodium hydroxide, Nitrogen gas in cartridges to prevent oxygen from reacting with the vasoconstrictor. L. Lignocaine, A. Adrenaline, S. Sodium metabisulfite, T. Thymol, M. Methyl paraben, D. Distilled water, S. Sodium chloride, S. Again sodium hydroxide, and nitrogen bubbles. Thank you for liking and sharing and remember to press on the like button below and subscribe.